I'm coming, my baby. Fuck it, the crack it up, break it, my baby. You in it? Uh, uh. Ten stacks here. I told you, call me ten stacks. I need that ten thou wow in the comments, please. Thank you. Um, hey, but look, this is the last episode of Worlds in here, and I'm done posting it because there's no more to drop. Like it's done. Um, if you've been enjoying the series, let me know down in the comments down below. Suggest new series. We finished like four or five within the last couple weeks. We need new stuff to watch. We started Golden Comedy. Y'all said y'all like that. Um, probably gonna bring out Food Wars. I heard some of y'all want Girlfriend and Girlfriend back. Um, finish JoJo's. I don't know what else to watch. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Suggest some stuff. I don't really like... I, I watched two episodes of Super, Super A-Zero and nothing went on. So I didn't post it. Like, I don't post bad content. I don't care if I have to get a video out. I'm not posting something garbage. Hey, but look though, right? With all that being said, smash the like button, subscribe, it's free, you know what I'm saying? And let's finish this series out. Let me know in the comments what you want me to react to next. Let's get it. Did this shit just skip back to when he met or to when he aged himself? Bro, I swear this show has no type of like logical storytelling at all. <laughs> So they aged him and gave him a whole new look. What was the point of that? If he was younger, he could live longer and you could be number one longer. I, I don't understand why she did that. Wait, wait, wait. This is the little girl that was pervy as shit. I guess that makes sense. Because her sister is nothing but walk-in fan service. But what was I going to say? Nigga, your little sister running around here offering men, grown men cock. Offer, offering to throw they, her mouth on them. And you're just okay with that? Nah, I ain't going to lie. My little sister was thought, nah, I'll, I'll be upset. <laughs> Real talk. Your little sister out here offering the mouth to a grown-ass man. You need to teach her a lesson, bro. She needs to be taught a good one. <laughs> Look at her, bro. Your little sister asking about sex. Bro, you need to teach her, like, no. Like, what the hell? She's in, like, middle school, bro. And she out, out asking about the meats. Bro, who, who let that happen? <laughs> in middle school, with cock on your brain. It's crazy. You got cock on your cranium? Ew, my nigga. <laughs> What's wrong with you? Sensei wa koko ni iru no. Bro, he's aged five years and is still worried about his teacher. What is wrong with this nigga? Like, seriously. You have a hose on deck and you still want that one bitch that don't want you. Bro, she left you. Move on. Like, I... Stop. Like, what's wrong with this nigga? That nigga do got a big mouth. Why are you telling all the bitches you know about what's going on? So if they snitch, then you get put in a position. They might kill you, nigga. You don't even know. Like, so what the fuck are you telling the plan for? This grimy bitch don't need to be around you. She's a fucking clone. And you know this now. Or you don't know this, but you can tell. The hell? Soda. <laughs> She just gave him the equivalent. If you want me to come, then make me do it. I'm with that. I ain't gonna lie, bro. I would have whipped my Johnson out. I ain't gonna lie. Look how she looking, bro. She really want it. Like, I promise you. I would have put this Johnson on, on, on demon timing. Real talk. <laughs> He's considering it. Finally, this nigga ain't bitching out. Like, every time he... Every time a woman says, let me get some. This nigga run away. At least he considered it. But don't say what's gotten into you, bro. Pull that thing out. Sure, what's cracking? I know you got a demon, bro. What's up? <laughs> if this was Issei already, he would have fucking gripped her fucking coochie. Like, come on, bro. Like, I don't give a fuck you're in love, nigga. Like, somebody off. She fine and she offer. If you don't take that shit, bro, like, come on, bro. And then when he finally decides to go through with it, somebody breaks in. I'm tired of this. The first couple episodes are good. And then it slowly just started failing me, bro. Like, what the fuck? Who? who why did they? Why did they limit this? I want to know. 
Because I know this shit got censored. To like, goddamn, like. Every turn is some even worse. This is by far the worst series I think I've watched in a minute. Oh, yes, ma'am. Hey, Kitara. God damn. I still want to make it squirt. She is so fine, bro. Dog. And the scene before, she was about five feet away. How did she grab the bitch and then... Bro, this anime is slowly making my body rock the more logic I put behind it. This shit don't make no sense. She was about 20 feet in front of them. How did she grab her and then... Where did she get the gun from? That's that's the biggest question here. She didn't have shit on her from what I saw. Like, what the fuck, man? <laughs> Are they trying to add politics into this already waste of a show? <laughs> There's no fucking way. She just said, I think a Japanese person should rule Japan. This show is slowly, slowly getting more and more dumb as it goes on. It's because in Japan, they censored it and, and, and cut it out a bunch of stuff. So literally, like, they just give you the main plot points with no context behind them. Are they trying to add politics in this bullshit? Because it's not going to work. Like, I, it already has been way too out of line. You know what I mean? I don't even know who all these people are. Bro, I swear they're just jumping through chapters. All these fine ass women in the room, and he don't want none of them. He want that whack ass fucking shaft scoundrel that's terrorizing the world. Like, come on, bro. I promise you, I'll be getting saucy on the beat. Meet home, one million. Like, come on, bro. Rado is just an LMC. Look at Nurse Joy on the right. Ready to throw the coochie at him and he, she, she, he just don't want it. Like, I promise you, I would have snatched that thing up and kept it. <laughs> so what happens when this boat is a trap and you can't trust nobody? That's just a thought in my head. Like, that's what it seems like this whole anime has been going. Nobody's been trustworthy. Like, what are the chances this is just another trap? That nigga did not do anything from what I saw. Bro, they cut out so much content. And I don't even know what the content is. They just cut it out. He did not do it. Y'all niggas weren't even together. Y'all was together for three episodes. And that's including the first two. Y'all just linked back together. So what the fuck is going on? Okay, you know what? Let's just let them conclude the show. So that's all. Hi. Them niggas have talked twice. So why are they, how are they just friends? Nigga like, I'm tired of this. I ain't gonna lie, the more, the more, the more, the more bullshit that happens, the more annoyed I get. Is she encouraging him to snatch that nigga's bitch? Cause he said shorty with the pink hair was pretty. Is she encouraging him to snatch a nigga's bitch? Cause if so, that's the most gangster shit I've ever seen in anime. <laughs> they finally linked and he ain't said nothing to her. He's seen her and just made a <gasps> noise. Like, nigga, what? <laughs> Bro, if you don't run up and throw your meat on that. He didn't even fucking kiss her. Like, what the? Alright, bro, that's enough. I don't, I. This does not deserve a second season. I can't believe I just sat there and stomached those last four episodes where they just butchered the entire shit. Um, if you're new, subscribe. It's free. I'm about to leave. This is stupid. Like the video. Let me know what you guys want me to watch next in the comments. That just made me so mad. Like, you have no idea, bro. I'm gonna catch y'all later.